Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Home Tastic by Rizwana. There are just few days left in this year and new year is on its way. So this is the right time to clean the houses, give a new look to your house because new year means new beginnings, new decisions and new excitement and many more. And I'm sure this video is going to give you lots of motivation and also I'll be sharing some awesome DIY ideas to decorate your living room. So on this occasion, I have got a new item for my living room that is this Rio sofa which I purchased from Amazon uh, for around 13,000. Actually, we used to have a Divan cot in this living room, but it's very old and already got damaged. But I wanted to have a very comfortable seating in the living room. So that's the reason I got this couch and this is so beautiful and quality wise it's very good. And there is no much assembling also. There are only four legs uh, that are given along with this package which can be assembled by ourselves. So we have put the sofa in this direction and now it's time to remove the old divan cot. I'll put it in another room but I'll get this restored again. And as you can see there are a lot of things under this bed right and this is the right time to declutter and remove the unnecessary things also. So finally after rearranging the thing this is the next day it was Sunday and I woke up early uh, to clean everything and give a makeover to my living room. So let's start with the cleaning first because cleaning is must. So I took a wet cloth and wiped out all the dust in the windows, grills and all. If you are going to clean the whole house in one day, it's going to exhaust you and also you will feel demotivated. So let's not do that. Just break down it into tasks like clean the windows in one day, clean all the shelves in one day. As we still have few days time, so by new year you will be able to clean all your house and also decorate your house and start fresh. So this time for a change I decided to change the decoratives in my living room also and there as you can see the wall is damaged because of the double sided plaster that I used in the past. Today I have a beautiful solution for you in just around 100 rupees so whoever has this kind of uh, damaged walls you can just go for that idea. So moving on here I am cleaning all the furniture. So I hope this makes you motivated to get up from your couch and clean your house also because cleaning depends on how motivated you are. Cleaning the carpets, doormats, rugs and all is a very big task and once those are clean it's like 80% of your house is also clean because those are the main things that trap lot of dust. And here I am removing the sofa covers, cushion covers and all and I'll be cleaning the sofa with some wet cloth. And now I'm done with my cleaning part so my living room is all clean now. It's time to give a makeover and also show you some DIYs. So for this new year I'm going to bring my old trunk into picture again. So today I'll be giving a makeover to this one. If you also have any trunks of this kind just take it out and give a makeover and use this as a decorative in your living room. So first I have painted this trunk with white acrylic paint. I have given two coatings so that it will look very neat. And on this I have made a Moroccan style cutout. Uh, so with that I will be making the design on this top part of this trunk. So whenever you want to paint, draw a design on the paper and make a cutout and then you can use that as a stencil. So this way my design is completed. Now I have to fill it with some red color. Why I have chosen red is because my sofa is also in maroon color, right? So to match with that, I'm just painting in this combination. You have to be a little careful while you're painting on the edges. Here I have shown this to you in just one or two minutes, but in fact it took me around two days because I used to work on this whenever I get free time. But this needs little patience also. Here using black 3D outliner I am giving outlines to this and coming to this wall I had told you in the beginning that this wall got damaged right. So to cover this I have a beautiful solution I had already told you right. So for that you just need some thermocol sheets. So here I have purchased a thermocol sheet for 30 rupees and in that I am making 3 pieces. 2 pieces of same size and 1 piece of little bigger size. Now let's attach a wallpaper on these sheets. 
This wallpaper I have purchased from Misho for around 200 rupees. Uh, if you don't have any wallpaper, you can also go for gift wrapping paper. But make sure that the design of the wrapping paper is uh, aesthetic and looks good. Like this, you have to attach this wallpaper or any paper on these thermocol sheets. This one is so simple, right? But this is going to help you a lot in case you are also facing this problem of flaky or damaged walls. And moving on, I have set of 7 frames, so I wanted to make a gallery wall. For that, I have downloaded some cute wallpapers from Pinterest and got the printout from the studio. So, I'll put these pictures in these frames. Now to make a gallery wall, there will be different different patterns that we can uh, make. I wanted to make this kind of pattern on the wall. So first I am attaching double sided plaster on its back. These frames are from Flipkart. I had purchased these long bag for around 300 rupees. I am not sure if the price is still the same or it's changed. But I will put the link in the description, you can check. These kind of gallery walls will make lot of difference and also it looks very rich and beautiful. Let me know how's this in the comment section and also if you have any doubts on how to download the pictures from Pinterest, I'll tell you. And moving ahead, I have two small wall shelves in this corner and for a change, I am just changing couple of things in these shelves so that it will match with the other elements of the living room. And here are my shelves ready. And coming to this corner, I have kept a small table and as you can see, there is a patch on the wall, right? So to cover that, I am going to put an artificial plant over there. These are actually artificial leaves that I purchased from Amazon. So these are set of four and looks like a real plant and I really love this one. So I have kept these in a vase and I will put that in that corner. This one is looking so cool and the patch on the wall is also not visible. This time I want to do some extra decoration because this is new year time right so I want to decorate the window behind this couch so for that I have taken this artificial flower vine and some lights and I'll wrap these two together and then I'll hang it on the window. Actually I have tied this vine along the curtain rod and it's looking so cute and pretty and now in the middle I will hang this beautiful dream catcher that I purchased long back from Goa. So this is red in color and it's perfectly matching with the couch so I was very happy with that one. And here I am, I have changed the curtains here also and in the center as you can see I have put the maroon uh, string curtains. And now comes the interesting part, here I had uh, already made these kind of frames right. So I will attach these on this wall, wherever we have patches I will just try to cover that with these frames. So please let me know how's this idea in the comment section. So this way we have covered that wall and it's looking so pretty now. And now moving on, it's time to change the cushion cover, sofa covers and all. These cushion covers are from pepperfry.com. I'll put the link in the description. You can check if you like it. And for the sofa, I'm laying this cream color sofa cover. And now coming to this cabinet, uh, here I have laid this uh, white color net cloth and on top of it I have put this maroon runner but later I removed it because I needed that on the center table. And here as usual I have kept it simple with some artificial plants and a tray with remote controls. And here comes my beautiful hand painted trunk. The reason I have kept it here is right above this we have gallery wall and here if we put this it can be used for seating purpose also. And now let's uncover this sofa and decorate it. This is so beautiful, so comfortable. This has become my favorite part in this living room guys. This sofa is from a brand 7th heaven. Uh, this is available on Amazon Flipkart and other websites like Paperfry also. I will put the link in the description you can check. As it is all maroon color, just to balance the colors and make it pop, I have put these yellow color cushion covers on this couch. And here in this corner, I have kept an indoor plant. On this side, I have my two-seater sofa as you all know. So on this one also goes the same cloth and the same cushion covers. 
and moving ahead here comes another important element of the living room that is carpet so for this one i wanted something in very light color because as you all see the sofa is in maroon color and i wanted something very light color so that it will brighten up this particular corner of my living room i have chosen this jute carpet because this might not trap lot of dust compared to the other normal carpets so keeping my baby in mind i have chosen this one and on this goes my center table and my beautiful maroon color table runner and on the center table i have kept this beautiful flower vase uh, which i purchased from meesho i have shown that in my last video and in that corner i have kept the small table and on this goes another flower vase and now to decorate your vase i'll show you one easy diy that's going to look very elegant and beautiful for this one you just need that green color decorative garland which we use for any kind of decorations so that i got for 25 rupees and i've taken a bullen pom pom you can take anything that is round or you can take a bottle cap as well we just have to wrap it around and make a ball and that's it it's as simple as that we just have to make six or seven balls like this and we have to attach a stick here i'm using bamboo stick to attach it or if you don't have bamboo sticks you can also use newspaper and make stick out of it so like this we have to do for all the balls and that's it my decorative flowers are ready let me show you how i styled it isn't it looking so pretty and elegant let me know your thoughts on this one now it's time to have the final look i hope you all will like it Now let me quickly take you through my living room. Here as soon as we enter, I have my beautiful sofa. What I liked most about this sofa is the fabric is so soft and it's made of high density foam and easy self assembly which I liked most. In case you are planning to buy any new couch, you can go for this which is very affordable and price worthy. And behind this we have a window and I had decorated this window with some beautiful uh, flower vines and some fairy lights. And in the center of the window I have my beautiful dream catcher that is completely matching with my uh, couch and other things in the living room. So this is how it is looking. Now coming to the center table on center table I have laid this maroon color table runner and on which I have kept three items and make sure to group the items in odd numbers always so here I have kept one artificial flower vase and my DIY flowers how are these flowers looking let me know in the comment section and a scented candle just for the sake of grouping the things in odd number and here I have my yellow color jute carpet which is so beautiful brightening up this corner and also it doesn't trap the dust much and here in this corner i have kept artificial leaves in this flower vase and this is how i have decorated these two shelves and here i have kept a small table and on which i have kept this flower vase that i purchased from meesho Uh, for all the links you can check my last misho home decor haul video and here comes my beautiful trunk and those two pillows are also from misho uh, i'll put the link in the description this can be used as a seating corner as well and here are my cute frames As you can see this time I have given a special decoration to my living room because it's new year time and really I am in love with this makeover and I'm really enjoying this I hope you also get some ideas with this video and also try the same in your living room as well So this is about that corner and on the other side I have another couch and above this I have made this beautiful and pretty frames let me know how is this looking on this wall Don't forget to let me know your thoughts on this video in the comment section whatever you have liked and which is your favorite part in this video today and if you have any better suggestions I would love to hear from all of you And here is my son enjoying the new living room So 
सो दिस इज़ माई फुल लिविंग रूम गाइज आई होप यू लाइक दिस वीडियो टूडे एंड इफ़ यू हैव रियली लाइक इट आई रिक्वेस्ट यू टू प्रेस द लाइक बटन एंड ऑल्सो इफ़ यू आर न्यू टू माई चैनल डू कंसिडर सब्सक्राइबिंग टू माई चैनल एज आई बी कमिंग अप विद मोस्ट अफोर्डेबल एंड रियलिस्टिक होम डेकर एंड होम मेक ओवर वीडियोज एवरी वीक सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर टूडे फ्रेंड्स लेट्स मीट इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो होपफुली नेक्स्ट ईयर अंटिल देन बाय एंड टेक केयर